guys so um, I know I haven't been vlogging um, very much lately um, there is a reason for that if you guys follow my um, Instagram or Facebook um, or just friends with me um, you know that um, I have had a very hectic last few weeks um first of all like justin's grandma died and we had that um wedding which you guys know was in the last vlog i believe the the wedding was for sure in the last vlog i don't know if i told you that justin's grandma died i think i did um so we had that and then um we had um, memorial day which i didn't want to vlog on memorial day there was just so much going on we always go up to the cemetery and visit some of justin's family and i did post that on my instagram um so we did that and um so yeah we had the holiday and then but before that justin um he ended up getting really really sick and actually being transported to the ER by ambulance um, and almost died <clears throat> um, so that was scary um, and then on top of that um, I got sick after he got sick and I I know I didn't have what he had I wasn't throwing up or anything and I didn't go to the hospital it wasn't near as bad as his but I just didn't feel very good um, so life has been like really really hectic for me lately um, so I haven't gotten the chance to like get the camera and, and vlog like I've wanted to um, so I apologize in advance for that um, Today's really the first day that I've like felt like I could actually like pick up the camera and vlog because I've had so many orders and the holiday and the stress of everything that has gone on is just throwing me through a loop and I've had a really hard time like coping with it. I've actually like I haven't gotten much sleep since um, the issue with Justin happened because I'm afraid that he's going to stop breathing because that's what happened. Um, he was really really sick and then all of a sudden like within an hour he just like stopped breathing and he couldn't breathe and it scared me and so I check him every like well the night that he got home I hardly slept I checked him like every 20 minutes to like hour I was checking him um but now it's gotten to the point where I, I just check him like every I want to say like three hours or two and a half hours two and a half three hours um i'll check him to make sure that he's still breathing because i'm terrified that he's gonna stop breathing um and i like hold my breath every day that he goes to school because he has physical training at school and he has had some muscle issues since um like since that incident of him being sick he's had like muscle issues because his limbs actually went like as straight as a board um and so he, like his muscles have been hurting since he's been transported to the hospital and um he has physical training and i'm like i'm paranoid that he's like gonna drop dead at like physical training I know that sounds really really morbid but I'm like terrified um so I like hold my breath every time he goes to school when he has PT and then like I wait for his call like I'm just I just have some um like post-traumatic stress um after this whole incident like it is definitely scared the crap out of me and I I can't function like anymore um anyway so that's what's been happening um I've just barely felt like I could pick up the camera um I felt like I could yesterday but my day yesterday was so busy so we a little bit of 
of an update about yesterday. We have Kuma. Um, we are breeding him with a female from Idaho. Um, and she is staying with us for this weekend. Um, so we're getting paid a stud fee to breed her and they have tied once. So I'm almost positive that they'll have puppies because he's very like, he's very fertile. <laughs> um, he has, his sperm count is a lot. So, um, cause he tied twice with another female and she had 11 puppies and they were all born healthy and none of them died, nothing like no problems with any of them. They were all born really, really healthy. So that was 11 puppies. So that's a big litter. So I'm pretty sure that she'll have puppies. Um, we're keeping her for the rest of this weekend, trying to get another tie, but they, he did tie once with her. Um, and then I have to take him back on Sunday. So um, that's what, we did yesterday and then on top of that I had to clean the house because my cousin and his new wife came over and we had dinner yesterday and watched a movie so um, we had to do that so I was just really busy with like everything yesterday um, today I'm on my way to um, give a customer her patches and then she's gonna take another patch order to somebody else for me um so oh, sorry this road is really really bumpy I need to get one of those things that you, like just suction cup to the window I can just put my camera up there but haven't gotten it yet um but yeah so I'm on my way to do that um, we're gonna meet at Home Depot. Kensley's in the back. Justin's at school right now. So, and he won't be back until later this afternoon. And then this afternoon I have lunch with my sisters. We're trying to figure out when, like what time works best for all of us to do a family reunion with my family, my immediate family, like my brothers and sisters and mom and dad um, and spouses because it's gotten to the point where our family is wanting to do a family reunion because everybody's kind of moving. Like, um, my twin sister, so for those of you who don't know, I am a twin. My twin sister is moving with her husband to Arizona, and we don't know how much we're going to see of them. Um, so that's, that's kind of hard. And then, um, my other sister, she's down here going to school, but eventually she'll get married and like I just we just feel like we need to start having family reunions with just our immediate family we've had family reunions with like aunts and uncles and stuff but like we feel like it's time to start doing it with our family so we have to figure out a time that works best for all of us we're thinking like July but we're not positive so um I will be recording bits and pieces of that which will be fun for you guys um, next month, or I guess this month, June, um, it's my birthday. So June 3rd is my birthday. So in a few days, like two days is my birthday. Oh my gosh. Um, that's like crazy to me. Um, but yeah, so two days from now is my birthday. And then we're breeding Kima in June. Um, so we have that to do and then hopefully we'll have puppies in August and then Destiny will come into heat um, sometime around September and hopefully we'll have puppies around December so we'll have Christmas puppies this year so um so yeah that's my life right now it's really really hectic it's really crazy with owning two businesses and trying to get those all figured out and um everything else um as far as like what material is gonna be on my channel from now on, I think I'll do a little bit of my service dog, but for the most part, I think I'm just gonna do like updates with my family because honestly, like I started vlogging for a reason and that reason was um, to pretty much have on camera 
my kids lives and pretty much have just like a journal like a video journal that's what I wanted because um I suck at actually writing and I don't I don't like sitting and just reading like I don't know like I have trouble reading other people's diaries like I know that some people like they have like their grandparents you know when their grandparents pass away they have their diaries and they sit and read them I can't do that but I want my kids to be able to um, if they want to like look back and see like oh this is the day like this is my six month update this is the day the first day I went to dance or this was my first dance recital or cheerleading practice or whatever like I just I want my kids to be able to do that um, and actually see it on video so that's what I originally that's why I originally started this channel and I think that's what I'm gonna start doing again um, is just doing like updates with my family and stuff like I think that's just what I'm gonna do like that's that's what I want to do with this channel um, like I'll definitely continue to do like training videos if you guys have specific things that you want me to cover in those training videos but I'm not going to I'm not going to um, like have that as the sole purpose of my channel if that makes any sense so um, I will be trying to change my channel name I have to figure out how to do that but I'm gonna try and change my channel name and just get back to what I originally started this channel to do so um, I hope that's okay with you guys I hope I don't lose you guys as viewers I hope you guys are you know I feel close to my followers and I hope I don't I don't know I just I hope I don't lose you guys as viewers um, just because I'm not doing like training videos and stuff like that like I'll still Apollo will still be in my videos along with my other dogs but I just I feel very strongly about doing these videos because like I I started this channel for a reason and I feel like I need to get back to doing that um, and doing the videos for that reason I didn't really do the videos for followers or a big YouTube audience or anything like that like to become famous or anything like that I didn't start this channel because of that I started it so that I would have documentation of my kids' lives and so I don't know that's that's just how I feel about it so um that's what I'm gonna start doing wow this guy is stupid this guy is right literally riding a bike on the freeway what an idiot um anyway so I'm gonna take you guys along with me the next few days and then I'll get this video posted up um, soon. So. <laughs> Jason, go, 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 look at her kick. There he is. <laughs> good boy, good boy. What did you say on him? She loves him. <laughs> yeah, you're really tall. You can't just like walk underneath the table, dude. <gasps> Say hi. Kuma. Kuma, come here. Kuma. 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 Excited. At least he doesn't get in our face. Yeah. Hey you guys, so it is Tuesday. Um, I was going to post this vlog up on Monday, but yesterday was my birthday and I had a ton of orders to get out and everything. If you guys follow me on Instagram or Facebook, 
you guys will know that I had a ton of orders to get out. So I got seven orders out yesterday and most of them had like four or five patches in them. So I had a lot to do yesterday. Um, so I didn't get this video up yesterday, but today is Tuesday and I am going to get this video up for you guys. I'm going to start getting on a regular like uploading routine again. Um, cause it hasn't been regular lately because I've had so much going on as I mentioned previously in this video. So, um, I'm hoping my life will settle down a little bit and I can start vlogging again. Um, Kensley's asleep right now, so I'm working on my patches right now. Um, I have quite a few orders to get out today as well. So, um, a little bit of an update though. Kuma tied with the female twice. So we got two ties in. So, and then, um, he came and picked her up and took her back to Idaho and, um, we get paid the rest of the payment, um, when the first puppy sells. So I'm super excited about that. Um, but yeah, so, um, I'm going to end this vlog here. Thank you guys so much for watching and thank you guys for your support. You guys are awesome and I will see you in my next video. Bye.